One more day. Hey. hey, we'll grab a seat. Uh, let's read a book. I probably won't be able to finish it, though. Because you know, it's three. Mm -hmm. A heart without essence is the essence of Bushuyo. Bushudio. Mm -hmm. Learning the spirit of the samurai seems useful, but this book looks difficult. Whoa. Still got some time to read. Let's go a little further. A heart that never backs down is the secret of the Bushudio. I'm definitely not saying that right. Bush, 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 blah, blah, blah. damn. Seems like you gained through but quickly. The guide on speed ring really helped. Well, how far did you get? Didn't finish it. Seems like you still have some pages left. Just continue another time. Almost at the station. Say it was an effective use of your time. Kawakami, give me some time so I can finish this book. Please. Please, Kawakami. Damn it. Today we're going over. Now then, please open your textbooks. Today we'll be learning about trigonomic function functions. Sine, cosine, and tangent. Oh, fuck. This is where a lot of people aren't able to keep up. Why would you panic just from seeing a graph? I don't get it. A complicated form gets condensed down to a single line. Isn't it simple and elegant? All of them have distinctive shapes since that simulate the imagination. Now, Canucks, son, take a look at these graphs. Give me an answer. Do you know the name of this graph? Your hint is snails. Uh, the devil's curve. Fuck. Because all math is evil. Precisely. That's correct. Don't you think it looks like a bit of a snail shell? There are many other graphs with amusing names. For example, the devil's curve is called that because it looks like a Chinese yo-yo called the Diablo. There's nothing particularly diabolical about it. Otherwise. Wow, oh, really? That song seems kind of smart, doesn't he? Nice Must be really smart to answer a question like that. I know. I have max knowledge. Why do I keep bothering trying to answer these correctly? Some people may think math is evil like the devil. But there's... Research that suggests that people who excel at math have higher incomes. If you're shooting for a high salary, fighting sometimes you need to be willing to fight demons. Uh. Honestly, I feel like fighting demons would be easier trying to understand graphs like that. Fuck that shit. Fuck math. Math sucks. Oh, hey -o. Oh, senpai. Yo, what up? There's something I'd like to discuss with you. Would you mind if I joined you for lunch? Uh, of course. Not at all. Thank you. All right, let's head to the roof. Why do you want to go to the roof for lunch? Are you planning on murdering me? It's starting to get rather cold, isn't it? Sorry to bring you here. This is something I oughtn't really bring up around other people. Senpai, are you still planning to continue on as the Phantom Thieves? Why do you ask? Lately, I haven't been hearing any positive gossip about the Phantom Thieves. Oh, I know. If you're asking if I killed that bitch, no, we didn't kill that bitch. Despite how much people cheered on your cause, even though they knew nothing about you or your friends, all they do now is speak ill of the Phantom Thieves. I know it's not my place to say this, considering I turned down your offer to join and all. But this change in attitude is simply awful. They're doing the exact same thing to you all that they did to me. Hmm. Yet, you're still going to keep at it? Why, senpai? There's unfinished business. Unfinished business? So, there's something left you have to do. Yeah. But don't worry about us. There isn't even a one in a million chance that my phantom thieves could ever lose. I see. Well, I won't stop you. However, could I ask a favor? Or rather... Could you promise me something? Once things settle down, I'd like you to join me somewhere so we can go have some fun together. I may not be able to. Damn. I promise. Then it's a deal. I'm already beginning to look forward to it. So, please be careful out there. Alright. Oh, but I plan to keep my other promise I made with you about the physical training. Tomorrow. Is that too sudden? Maybe we should train the day after tomorrow, then? Uh, but that day's when... Yeah. Maybe another time. <laughs> mm. I see. Mm. Oh, I haven't eaten yet! <laughs> Come on, 
senpai. You need to eat too. I have so bread. A fight on an empty stomach, you know. I have bread. <laughs> bread. Bread. Mm, bread. Yeah, literally tomorrow. We've had the last 20 days to hang out, and you're like, you know what? How many days left till we send the calling card? One. We'll make sure you're ready for it. Sending it tomorrow, motherfuckers. Are you busy? Ugh. Ugh. Nah, we're gonna go hang out with Haru. Or Futaba. Haru. Yo, what up? <laughs> That's slow. Stand up and turn around. We just need to wait till the day of the announcement. Then, until the day, until the announcement, I'll be taking care of the plans till then. Nice. Is this something you need in the meantime? I came to see you. I'm sorry. I was thinking of going home after checking the plans today. Feel free to contact me in case I'm ready. I'll gladly come. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. I'm not hurt! <laughs> God damn, okay. Futaba? Alright, fine, we'll go hang out with Futaba. Uh, back streets. I really wish I went just to hang out with Futaba in the first place, because now my feelings are hurt. <laughs> Yo. Yo, what up? We gotta wait for our scheduled day now. Hmm, you're free, right? That's something I want to talk to you about. It'd be awesome if you can make time for me. Yeah. Hang out with her. Yep. Okay. Let's go to your room then. Hey, listen. So I emailed Kana-chan. But then believe it or not, she replied. That's pretty cool. I just realized I have two tabs open for Haru's confidant. Oh, for fuck's sakes. I just like, why the fuck do I keep opening the Haru tab? Because oh, I have two open. Nice. Believe it or not, she replied. She even ended up talking on the phone about elementary school. She said the only reason she got mad at me is because she was embarrassed. Apparently, she thought I would hate her if I knew her about secrets, so I, she ran away. I guess me and her are pretty much the same after all. Long story short, we made up and finally apologized to her. That's incredible. Yeah, that's incredible. Really? I'm surprised you're so excited about it. I'm glad. Anyway, it's far too difficult to visit each other, so we'd send emails back and forth. We had a promise recently we both go to high school next year. You know, there's no way I would have been able to call her and apologize before. <laughs> it's all because of you I could do it, Soviet. You worked really hard, too. You're making me blush. You're making me blush. Mm, then I'll have to compliment you some more. Blush for me, Soviet, my super cool protector of justice. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. Kana Chan was really surprised the fan of these listened to her request. She never know the truth of the matter, though. <laughs> finally, get along. Finally, finished that promise. Get along with Kana Chan. Uh, this is really important, so I'm going to say it again. Thanks. Thank you, Soviet. Wait, a second time? I, even, I never even said it the first time. That means I got to say it again now. Thank you, Soviet. Seriously. I feel a, st a strong bond of trust from Futaba. Nice. Next time we hang out with her, we're going to be romancing her. So, yay! Um, This is is okay if I ask you a favor real quick. I mean, I just finished a super old promise. So, um, can you pat me on the head? My mom used to do it when when she was happy with me. Just pat, pat. Can you do it? <sighs> Fine by me, I suppose. All right, All right bring it on. <gasps> Whoa. That was totally different from how my mom used to do it. My heart, my face, it feels like they're on fire. Pat, calm down, Futaba. Oh, no. <laughs> Phew. Looks like that strange outburst is finally over. My heart's still pounding real hard, but I'm totally good now. Sorry for making you worry. I just remember I still have one more promise to do. Be okay without you around. Can I really do this? Is this really possible? And eh, maybe I'll find out some other day. Maybe. Excuse me. Peace out. I walked for Tubba home. Nice.
Thanks, Soviet. Hey, Soviet, thanks for listening to what I had to say today. So I've been having a lot of fun talking with Kano-chan over the internet. We talk all the time now. We tell each other what we're doing, what our days are like. Kano-chan says she even cried when I reached out to her. When I heard that, I kind of cried a little too. But now I'm getting along with Kano-chan, so I cleared that goal. Congrats. One more pass. <laughs> what? Don't tease me like that. I might freak out again. Anyways, I just have one more goal to clear, and I'm about to face the final boss. Once I beat it, it's game over. Credits roll. I hope you stick around till then, Soviet. Okay, later. Yo, what up? Well, Tomorrow's the day. Once you send that calling card, there's no turning back. Make sure you pair you finish preparations tonight. All right. Shall we test tonight? Sure, why not? The shop's open again today, so I'll be waiting. All right. Are you sure you're going to be okay? I sense, I can sense just by looking at your face the death aura is emitting a strange light. Please be careful. Well then, what would you like to do today? Do a verification test. The tower card has grown dark. Do you expect some sort of change at a high altitude? The tower card? Tower? Who the fuck's tower? Hold on. Decline. Who's tower? Fool, Arcana, Priestess, well, Magician, Empress, Emperor, Hero, Lovers, Chariot, Justice, Hermit, Fortune, Strength, Hang, Death, Temper, Devil, Tower, Skilled Gamer. Oh! That makes sense. Because I haven't hung out with him, like, at all. What shall we do? All right. Uh, special fate reading, view all characters' confident abilities, affiliate reading. Uh, you, because you said you wouldn't rank up, you dumbass. That doesn't you? Thanks. Here we go. What do you think? Um. Do a vacation test. I was going quite dark. Oh, that's so sad. My fucking Christ. Fucking. Hang out with her. Maybe we should invite her to Sky Street. Uh, don't invite her, actually. I'm going to save first. Wait, I, I literally just said don't invite her. Oh, for fuck's sakes. That means we're just going to sit here and talk. God damn it. Goodbye. Fucking shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck, 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 